Shortly after arriving, the Syrian government delegation submitted a negotiating position to the UN Special Envoy, Stefan de Mistura, but not publicly. The UN Envoy will make use of the weekend to study in depth our paper and then submit it to the other groups and will come back to us as to our amendments on this paper. When the opposition emerged from a separate meeting with the UN's envoy, they weren't in a mood to compromise. You have heard the attack carried out by the government. This is what it usually does before every round of talks. The government is sending a strong message that it doesn't want a political solution, but a military solution that will bring destruction to the whole country. Syria's main opposition actually went into some detail about what it wanted a transitional body to look like. But one of the members of its delegation here said that before agreeing on any of those points, it first wanted to settle the future of Bashar al-Assad. But Syria's president won't be discussed until Monday when formal talks reconvene. And by then, some fear the six-week cessation of hostilities may have all but collapsed. Guy Henderson, CCTV, Geneva.